What's up, man? What's up? We back again. Another update on my cash app and my investing tools. So, right now, what I need you to do is just like, comment, subscribe. Y'all know the drill, man. I'm about to get into it. Let's get it. All right. So, basically, as you guys know in my last video, if you haven't seen my last video on the cash app investing, I will leave a link in the bio just so you can take a look at it. But if you remember what I started with, I'm going to show you now what I have. Now, of course, I made some some more investments. Now, I'm at 313. And, you know, for the most part, let's get into some new stocks and the stocks I already previous owned. So I'm going to start with the Nike again because, uh, you know, this is this is like a good stock of mine. Uh, it basically went up total gain $16. As you can see, I invested $107. So I own a complete share pretty much. Now, what I plan to do is build this portfolio. I don't plan to sell it no time soon. I'm going to buy some more shares of my stock. And remember, when I first bought my stock, my first stock was 87 20 cent. These are two, you know, just a couple of times I put money towards the stock. You know, just if you go spend money anywhere else, why not just go spend $10, $5, whatever you can afford is up to you. But yeah, spend a little money. That's, that's going to hurt. Um, So yeah, as you can see, this is the update for the Nike. Now, my new stock, which, you know, obviously this stock right here, I bought a couple of more shares. Not just a couple, but I bought 33 shares of this share price. It was at $1 by the time I think I bought it for the first time. So you know, today was a good day because it's been, it been going up and down. So as you can see, I invested $41 and total gain of 46 Now, this is Hertz. Now, as you know, for those who don't know, but for the ones who do know, if you are into investing in stocks, Hertz just went bankruptcy, right? So we're going to take it here. We're going to go and go here. And we're going to just click on some things. Now, as you can see, her stock price skyrockets 825% since filing, filing, filing for bankruptcy. It skyrockets. That's a little, I mean, that's a little surreal, but I mean, it's true, you know? So for the most part, now this is the car rental place. Me personally, the reason why I went ahead and bought this because it's, it's a company that's been around for quite a little bit of time. And I personally feel like, you know, at the the pandemic and all of this the stuff that's going on right now with society i personally feel like with the loss of cars of people you know what i mean people who couldn't keep up who were living check by check and that was the only way they were able to make their payments now you know had to probably get some vehicle stripped from them so i feel personally that hertz is going to shoot up back when everything gets back rolling because people are going to be in need of cars i mean that's just it's just, you know, the human psychology thing I was telling you guys about from my last video on the Cash App, it's real. You got to just think, you don't think for anybody else for the most part. You think you do your own evaluation for the most part. So this is Hertz. So I went and bought 33 shares of that, man. Like, I'm looking to see what happens, you know, long term. I'm not really looking so much to see right even when everything bounced back. I'm looking past that. So I think that was a good move by me personally. Um, you feel what I'm saying? So yeah, if we go back, you go to the Exxon Mobil. If you paid attention from the Exxon Mobil, total investment was forty eight dollars. I gained a total of almost nine dollars. Now the share price right now is fifty three dollars. Fifty three dollars. When I got this stock, it was forty three ninety nine. See what I'm saying? That was May seventh. The is come on, you guys can do the math. So. Think long term, no, you know, just 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 imagine, ask yourself that question. Just imagine five years from now, if you invest into that one stock, that one share, and 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 then when you plan and you feel like it's okay for you, and you you've reached a certain interest rate for yourself, then that's when you decide to sell. And who knows what it will be worth by the time, you know. So that's what I keep in mind, you know. Now, another stock, General Electric. Now. This stock, I believe, um, yeah, I think when I got it, it probably was around like seven, seven dollars. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, like seven dollars. So two shares, yeah, like seven dollars. So I bought two of those. Um, and yeah, as you can see, I invested in fourteen, and I already got back two dollars. 
Now, now, just the little gains, what I want you guys to pay attention to is the little gains that I'm getting while we're in a crisis. It's gains. Now, as you can see, my whole portfolio are all plus, meaning it's making some progress. You know, so these are what I'm going to be building on. And, yeah, so, I mean, you guys see it is is legit. I'm at 313. If someone can comment and tell me <laughs> From my first video, the difference between this 313 now and whatever it was before, that'll let you know from that time span of how much I've been making and, you know, just from the little small investments I've been showing you. I'm already totally in my whole portfolio. I'm already invested in $238. That's that's what I did. And I gained 75 already back of that. Come on, man. This is, this is, it's like a game for me. I wake up Monday through Friday. Eight nine o'clock to four p.m. You know, and you just watch the stocks, man. You just pay attention. You you practice on movements if you want to trade week, month, a year, or well, damn near, you know, forever. <laughs> I don't know. So you guys, let me know what you think. You know what I mean? And I'll definitely keep you guys updated with more stocks. I feel like you know will be a good hit or miss. And yeah, I'll keep you guys informed for the most part. You know what I'm saying? Just follow the kids, share love. You know what I mean? And that's just it. We're we going to get to it. Whoever wants to follow me and be a part of this journey, because I think this is cool. This is something new, and it's, 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 it's exciting to me, you know, to be honest. It's like a new skill and task. So you guys keep paying attention. Do your own research. Don't listen to nobody else. You will make the best judgment for yourself.